Hello, my friend, my friends, <laughs> or I don't know, maybe there is individual personal group of the peoples. Um, anyway, so uh, this is the second part, which is string operations. The first part, uh, which is about string, the subtopic, we have two subtopic in this case, which is uh, storing strings in like storing strings in variable. The second part string operations. Let's start from this part. I will be very fast. Just follow me in fast way. OK, just I will give you some example with the Python and with the JavaScript and we will continue very good. OK, let me start it. First, computer programs don't don't like don't just store uh, strings they also manipulate them with string operations we can jump like strings up mash strings together or transform strings in all sorts of ways okay combining strings right let's come down this is subtopic of string operations okay combining strings uh, da, 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 da. yeah we love coming up with new lingo in computer, computer programming land. Uh, one word you probably never used before is concatenation. Concatenation, which is, it means like you're just bringing two things next to next. Um, it can be anything, just we bring it next to next. Concatenation, okay? Combining them. And it's our fancy way of describing how we combine strings together. This is what string concatenation looks like in JavaScript. It's like that, var, so variable name, it's Winston, uh, variable greeting equals hello. After that, so the double, double quotes, uh, in double quotes we have parameters in string, I mean, uh, hello, and after that one comma, and after that one space, which is that point and after that we say plus name let me show you let me show you very fast that but um uh yeah let me do it so i i will be very fast okay let's say var name equals to this is our variable name name um after that let's say winston Winston, right? After that, close. We have double quotes, and in double quotes, we have parameters. Winston, okay? Put semicolon here. After that, let's say enter and define because why? We so still we didn't output it. Okay, after that, let's say variable greeting equals to what? Equals to hello, I think the first one, right? Hello, our first string, like double quotes, let's open it. Hello, after that, put comma, and one space, because we want to put between name and hello, one space. So if you didn't put this space, like if we do it like that, it will be like, it will concatenate them, all of them, in the same way, like, hello, Winston will be there, with the a narrow point okay so we should put one space there like bam okay after that let's say plus the concatenation mean addition we'll put our variable name name after that let's say enter after that let's come here console.log and after that put greetings here our variable and close that put comma yeah so semicolon hello Winston, it's our space here, okay? This point. In Python, we can do it, let's hide it, okay? In Python, we can do the same things, name Winston, okay? Uh, close this, double quotes. After that, let's say, um, creating, creating equals, um, hello, like, hello comma after that put space close that after that put addition addition mean concatenation okay after that put our variable name it will concatenate all of them like name in this case after that let's say print greeting close that yeah hello winston it works okay that's clear and let's say python again okay 
Now, let me make it like that, clear. The creating variable stores the result of concatenating two strings, chaining, in, chaining the two strings together. In fact, the word concatenation means chain together, like you're bringing things next and next. It comes from Latin con, which is together. Con means together. And catene, like catene point is chain, like uh, together chain mean, okay? Concatenation, okay? We can chain any number of strings together. How we can do it? Let's do it together. Now what we did? We do it, we did hello Winston. Let's put hello Sir Winston together. Okay? How we can do it? Let's try it. And also I will show you one buggy, one bug there, and we will try to solve it. Okay? How we can solve it? Let's come first here. We have var name winston right after that put it here and after that title will be equals what sir right sir close that yeah but we didn't put it sir let's say um no 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 and let's say war title equals sir right after that put semicolon yep now it's also here what we have now name and title after that let's say var greeting equals to hello comma one space close double quotes it is our variable so it is our strings string and after that put plus which is concatenation after that let's say title like hello sir plus what plus name hello sir winston but in this case we don't have any space between them just we can concatenate them like that like what sir sir winston it will look like that because we don't have any space between them like that how we can do it we can do it like let's put another space and put here double quotes and bam space put space between them okay now it will work it will look like sir winston but in this case let me show you with the wrong one after that we will solve together how we can concatenate them in good way okay let me put their semicolon after that let's say console.log and let's come here, say greetings, greeting, I mean, yeah, close that, let's say enter, hello, Sir Winston. Did you see? We don't have any space between Sir and Winston. How oh, we can solve it? Let's come back again here, and let's put, after title plus, like addition, let's put double quotes, and after that, in double quotes, let's put one space. The space will put their space between name and title. Now, let's also put here addition, like concatenation. Now, it will concatenate all of them with, with together. And after that, uh, I did wrong again. Yeah, let me put it here again and one place. Oh, again, I did wrong. Um, okay, yeah let me put it here okay now let's say let's enter now if you say console.log it will show us true bam hello sir winston now we have space between them right it works in python we can do same operation like what we can say what we have we have name winston right we have title equals what, sir? Um, after that, we have greetings. Greeting, greeting, let's say greeting, and equals hello, comma. After that, close double quotes. We have space also, plus sir, sir variable here, title, title, and after that, plus, and what? Plus, we should put their space between uh, between title and name, between Winston and Sir. How we can do it? Let's do again. One, double quotes, 
another double quotes so one quotes another it will be double quotes after that put space between them and let's say again concatenation which is addition part and after say after that let's say name let's say okay okay now if we look at grading uh, this is reverse <laughs> um let's say grading close that bam hello sir winston in python it will look like that this is easy method it will work for everyone okay let's say python again let's come back and clear also here let's come down yeah we fix it so the same things like mm, notice we are concatenating coded strings with variables we call the coded strings string literals um this is key points since they are literally a string while the variables represent a string too uh, the program below displays the result of that code. You know, there's something not quite. Da, 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 da. Yeah, we did same things from here. I already did in that point. So it's okay. Let me come down. Check your understanding. Imagine our program start with this line or nickname Splashy Pants. Okay, let me put it there. That started were uh, Nick after that. Let's do upper this n name because we are representing variables like that. Nickname equals to splashy, splashy hands, right? Double quotes. This is string now, right? Put semicolon. Bam. It's okay. What it's saying after that? Select the line of JavaScript code that successfully stores the Creating a hoy after that a hoy comma one space splashy pens after that like what bam bam yeah we have what mark <clears throat> yeah that one this is crazy point okay let's come down how we can do it what we have let's take pencil okay we're creating a hoy yeah, one space, that's true. After that, we don't have any plus here between them. So normally we should put here plus, also here one plus. If we do it, we can concatenate all of them. But th this is wrong one. It will not work. The second one, we're creating a high and plus. That's good. Nickname plus. Bam. That's true. It will work. Okay? Because a high, then plus. So we have also space. It will look like a hoy splashy pants. And after that, we have concatenation here, addition part, so addition symbol. Also, it will concatenate with the, that one to nickname. So it will look like that. Okay? That one is true. So the other is also wrong because we don't have plus and in, the, in some case different. Yeah, the answer is that. How we can prove it? We can prove in this way like that. Let's come here. <clears throat> so let me see what readings reading equals ahoy um, comma one space close per like close double quotes this is our string and after that put plus and after that say nickname already there after that if we say like if we do it like what if you do it like that, like that, it will not work. We should put here what, you know? So also let's tag this comma. Comma also will not work. We should put concatenation symbol like plus. It will work now, okay? Let me put semicolon. Yep. Now let's check it. Console.log after that creating. Bam, close. Put semicolon, hot, splashy pants, and after that, this. Yeah, what we are, so what we look for that, this one, it is true, right? We did same. Okay, we solved problem. Then other topic, slicing a string into substrings. Oh, this is amazing helper building function. This is command, okay? 
uh, in Python, this is slicing a little different. In JavaScript, we can do it with substring, which is sub str. We can do it in like that. But in Python, we can do it with variable. Then variable, we should open their list. After that, we should put our start and length. After that, steps. Okay, this is three point. But in JavaScript, this is start position and length of the verse like what i will explain we can also do the opposite side of con uh, concatenation uh, we can slide a screen slice a string and just store that slice we call that slice a substring uh, one way to slice the javascript is with a substring which is sub str after that so we're opening par like parentheses so command this is command it tags two parameters which is start position how we can say start position let's say we have here harry the age will be zero one two three four like you know it will go like that zero index one in the first index second index third index fourth index and five index it will be like that okay so the length will be the the length of the verb like harry in this case one two three four five five uh, letters coming next to next this is length of our words the start position is zero the length of the word word is the five. Oh, that's that like substring okay zero zero starting from here and the five zero one two three four five okay this is uh length of the hairy how we can prove it how i can convince you for that okay let me show it you let's come here and say let's do with alert okay alert just i want to <laughs> output from here maybe you can see clearly after that let's say what you know let's say harry harry potter string this is our string with double quotes after that also close parenthesis okay let's come here and put that it's like build function build in function okay now we should see our comment here what we have we have lots of procedures or functions or methods to do it okay lots of option but we will work with what will work with substring this one okay substring after that come here and open another parenthesis it's saying from one point like the start position and the second parameter is length the first parameter start position the second parameter length okay let's look for the start position start position in this case the age which is the zero right this is zero one two three four it will be like that so this one is four so let's put zero start position is zero age it's starting with age right put comma so put comma between them after that length of the words harry this harry occurring with the five letter like h a r r y yeah this is five so let's say five i want to get this five from there i put semicolon um harry we get from harry potter only what we want like we like we would like to get from there um harry okay this is our point like how we can get what we want in this case let's say we want to get potter how we can do it zero one two three four five six it will be six right let's come here and say it will be six start position and after that the potter will be also six the, the length of the potter right this is p o t t e r the six let's say like that what it will look like potter did you see did you see that so what if we want to separate and to get from harry potter let's say full name equals but 
put their variable really i want to i'm trying to um help you to understand this situation because this is very important in the future you'll work with it okay let me start again first we'll say var after that full name equals harry harry potter okay harry potter you can put your name to your full name after that let's put it there bam okay we want to get from here what we want to get var name like sorry name equals what now in this case we will say full name yeah this is our variable we will go inside it with the dot if we say dot we we will work on full name like we want to get something from inside it okay we will say substring right open it yep we can get what we want in this case we want to get Harry we will say start position is zero which is age and the length this is our second parameter will be like uh, sorry Harry the Harry occurring with the five letters we'll say five in this case put semicolon yeah this is our name variable right now in name variable we have harry what if you want to get also surname like where surname equals full name again we are looking inside full name with the like building method so uh the command i mean let's say in substring open it the start position 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 6 will be p um the from p the length of the this uh, potter it's six right p o t t e r this is six also close that put semicolon bam now we have name and surname if you want to uh let's say if you want to concatenate them also in the same way it will be again like let's first um alert them uh like display them in, in the alert function let's say first name harry let's look for the second one alert surname Potter. Yeah, this is the second one. Let's say alert full name. Right? Full full name. I did like that, I think. Harry Potter. What we did here, we got what we want from full name. We got name and we get surname now we can work with them all the way but the point is like you can understand how we can get information from the variable like how we can bring another strings in another variable okay how we can attend so the point is that like in python also we can do same thing let me like i can do it let's say we have full name equals Harry Potter plus that bam now uh, okay let's say we want to get name from full name with the substring methodology but in Python it works different we don't have substring like method or function or the building function we have like list methodology but don't think too much about it just learn how to do it okay first we saying here full name after that let's open here list okay it works like that in this case what we are doing you know we will say our start position is zero like before after that let's put two dot bam uh, 
upside like that. It's not semicolon. After that, let's put our length. The length in this case, again, 5, right? Because we are looking from 0 index to uh, 5, like this point, right? So, what it will look like? Let's do print name. Harry, we get it from there, right? If you want to get a surname, let's say surname equals again full name and put open list how we can slice it in case let's say again like before six by six but it will not work with the comma let's do it like that do you think it will work what do you think hmm? <laughs> do you think it will work like that let's try it print surname will show nothing let's do it like what this is start position let's say um, this is start position from Harry Potter this is start position 6 7 8 9 10 11 let's say 11 you think it will work let's say print surname okay why Potter? Because if you say this one is 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, we should put one case more. So because it will start 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, we should put like what? One more, okay? Like that. Look, if you say that, let's say print surname. It will show us Potter because why? If you say 11, it will not get 11. It will look like between 6 and 12. And we can find their Potter, okay, in this case. So we can do one more thing. I don't want to mix your brain. I don't want to mix your brain. But we can do one thing more because we have three parameters in Python in this case. If we want to get... Uh, with the two steps uh, for the potter, let's come for the potter part. Let's put here one more and say, I want to get this information, surname information with the two steps. It will jump with two steps. Like first it will take P, where is it? Yeah, P, after that it will take T, after that, it will tag E, like P, T, E. It will get these three things. Because we said we want to get from 6 to 12 this uh, word, Potter. After that, in Potter, we want to get step the first P, uh, like each, each, uh, each uh, two letter, each two letter, P, bump, jump to. T jump to E. Okay, let me let me prove you. Print surname. Bam. P T E. Okay, this is Python method. Okay, at uh, Python strategy. In JavaScript, we can do also same thing, but in different method. Okay, so let me clear it, and after that, let me do it Python again. I don't want to mix your brain. I told you again, like before. I showed you lots of things, <laughs> okay? This is okay. But it's saying uh, substring, let's come down in JavaScript and most languages, the first position of the string is index zero. Like what? H will be zero, A will be B1. In programming languages or in programming, everything starting from zero index, okay? So the humans are generally saying one, two, three, four, five. It's all the way going like that. The human will look like H1, A2, R3, R again, R4. But in computer programming, the thing starting from zero index, okay? Like zero, one, two, like that, okay? It's starting from zero. Anyway, in this case, I showed you zero, five, 
the 6 to 11, but in this case, this is 12 in Python in JavaScript too. So uh, anyway, let's come here. That line of code starts at index 0, h, and returns to five character long string Harry. And of like n of by one error is a common kind of logic error that can happen very when you're dealing when you are dealing with indices like indices and accidentally used to high or low an index whatever language and command you are using make sure you understand exactly how that command works and always check your output yeah the program below stores multiple substrings from one string, a phone number, try to edit the code to store a third substring extension number. So in this case, we want to get the one extension number, okay? Extension number one. We will put the variable extension also. Let's come here. Let's do it together. We have full, no full number, like full num, array code, and local num. First, we'll put all of them. After that, we will check, okay? The first full number, I want to do my number. You can do your number, okay? Or we can do arbitrary numbers. It's not important. I, I will do for Turkish number. You can do for your country also. Just you should understand concept, okay? Let's come here and say var. Full num equals what equals let's say I want to do let's put double quotes because we'll work with substring right this is not number in this case the number will be in string um let's say plus 90 this is country code array code after that let's say 544 four, February and seven like eight nine seven and two three two five I don't know what is it but which number maybe you can call this will be another people um okay let's say semicolon let's put semicolon and the first take from full number to Area code. How we can do it? Area code. The, we can create the variable area code. After that, let's say equals to. After that, let's get information from full num variable. Let, we can say full num. That, because we will go inside it. We will get with the command, right? This is Boolean method. Let's say substring. After that, we have two parameters. The first one from start position, the second one length. Start position is zero, right? The length is what? Let's tag in this case the plus two. Um, or what do you think? Can we get it? Yeah, let's do it one like because now we put start position it's plus like zero uh, in computer programming the length of the, this like the uh, area code is three one two three right let's put three for length well close that what happened i did something wrong uh syntax error Da, 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 full num, full num, it's okay. Area code. I think I did something wrong here, but I didn't know. After argument list. Oh, I think something, uh, what is the problem? Missing after argument list. Where is the missing part? Full number, substring, array code, full num. Yeah. Um. The missing is that one, it's saying substring, okay, but ah, full num, yeah, that's okay, okay, 
yeah the problem is here what can be sometimes you are like blame you know <laughs> you're just checking what's wrong here um the full name full num here in this case is number zero one two zero three yeah what's wrong here i didn't understand syntax error full num yeah after that let's say what is that i think uh, what's wrong here substring after i added it a record is um uh, start position that 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 the full number area card uh what can be wrong here i'm just checking it area code full num substring uh, uh zero let's say the one oh still same let's say four yeah still same what's wrong here really maybe some substring not working for that say substring no, it's still same. That's clear here. Come back to this part, and let's represent this again. Yeah. After that, let's save our array code. Yeah. Yeah, it will be again like that. Our array code, full num, full number. Right, right. Is that? After that, zero, one, two, yeah, zero, the length of that, three. Why it's saying that? Like, argument is missing that. What is missing part here? Um, substring is in, why not working in this case here? Um, let me check it in clear way, okay? Let me do one thing. Let's say console.log. So that, let's say full num, 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 but substring. If it not works also here, it will be problem. Three and bam, close that, put it here. Yeah, it works, but in this case, why it's not working in variable? Okay, let me come again, like, let me come again here. After that, say, var area code equals full number, like, full num. Um, let me write it again. Yeah, full num at substring 0.3. Yeah, yeah, it works. I don't know what this problem here really, it makes me crazy. Yeah. Var, after that, let's look for the local number, which is in this case, our local number will be five, four, four, and eight, nine, seven. Okay. In this case, let's think like that. We'll get it. Okay. How we can do it? Let's do it with local num local num equals full num dot substring da, 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 da. yeah zero one two three zero one two three yeah three after that it is four start position is four yeah the length of that six value the let's say one two three and we have space this is one two three four space four the eight five like six seven we have seven right let's say this is length of this seven um okay the last one we are looking for what um let's say 
local number and the last one will be what let's say the private private phone number like let's say uh phone number um yeah I really do something crazy like that but let's do it with the uh, parameter var um, phone number yeah let's do it like that uh okay private number let's say private um, private num our variable name equals full num dot string open it again in this case the index 0 1 2 all right 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 um it will be like uh 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 the start position is 12 yeah the length of this number what in this case one two three four four right let's say four close that ah. private number now let's look all of them in the case alert the first one what uh, area code right area code the second one will be what the second one is the local number let's put it also here it will look like very crazy after that let's put this third one our third parameter private number let's close it and come it's only showing us what class 90 let's say okay what it will look like in this case if we do it like that let's look it will show us with only that alert but if we do it with the console.look what it will look like let's put first area code after that local num after that what after that private number in this case private number can be extension okay you can think like that it's no matter because we are working on it yeah the number already here did you see but if you want to show only the area code let's say console.log area code um area code console.log only local number we want to get local number we already represent it right we already substring like slice it with the way bam our local number let's say we want to get the private point like private number right private num bam close that okay this is our private number point i think you get it right i did different uh, example in python let's say in python we can do also same things let's come here and say what you know just say yeah full num equals open because we are working on string let's say plus 90 and mm, let's put different things here now five, like five takes one seven eight seven and 90 91 yeah in this case like that after that we want to get what like don't say war okay in this case let's say area code just like that equals full num um we should open list like that to get information inside it in this case we want to get this plus 90 right what we can say we can say um in this case i will show you just don't worry about that okay 
Yeah, in this case, you will win everything, right? In Python, let's continue. So, what we should put here? The first plus 19. The start position is 0, right? And then put it here like that, the list methodology. And after that, we have 1, 2, 3. But this is between 0, 1, 2, 0, 1, 2, right? If you say 2, what it will be? It will give us 0, 1, 2, this 3 variable. So 3, sorry, 3, 1, u. Let's try it. It will work. What do you think? If you want, you can pause it. I can try it so I can. It will show us only that. Because why, you know? We should put here 3 because 0, 1, 2. It will say, oh, okay. I will get only from that point to that. It will show us only plus 9. The 0 because will be this point, right? The This point, it will not work. Okay, if you say three, bam, let's say print. And after that, array code, it will show us that, okay? So what do you think if we do it uh, for the uh, local number? Local num equals full num, Open list point again. In this case, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. Let's say 4. After that, let's continue because we are looking all of them 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. In this case, 11, right? Bam! Let's close it. Print. I did also wrong for the LG. O and LGO. I did I, I did wrong variable name num. Yeah, I don't want to I don't want to make it again. Print. Yeah, we get it. Okay. After that, let's say we want to get last extension. You can think like or private. Let's say private in this case. Private num equals full num um, open list. And come here again, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 11, then what? 12, yeah? Did you think it's, so do you think it's 12? After that, 12, 13, 14, 15, 15, 16. Let's put 16 like that. Yeah, will it work? Print private num. Yeah, it works. So it is amazing point. Also, we have different ways to do it. We can also do it like what, you know? We can say minus one, bam, and minus five. Let's do it like that. Will it work? In private noun. Yeah. But it's showing us nothing. But what if you, what if you do it? Just show me minus five, bam, like that. What it will show us? Hmm? Let's say private, like print private num. Again, our numbers here. Did you see? Because it's saying, Minus 5 mean it's coming from here. Minus 1, minus 2, minus 3, minus 4, and minus 5. It's tagging from this point. Okay? I hope you got it. But this is advanced. Okay? You learn everything from basic to go, like from scratch to point. Okay? This is way. Okay, let me clear here. Mm -hmm. Let's say Python again. And come back to here. After that, also clean this point. I think you got it. Everything good. Bam, we did it. Other string operations. We have lots of way to do things, you know? It's amazing ways working with us. 
Yeah, now other string operations mean we have another commands or another functions or procedures or methods to work on strings. Okay, in this case, commands staying there. Combining, it is combining, I forget, put here key. Combining and slicing strings are just two ways so we can manipulate string variables depending on what you are trying to do in your program. You may want to modify strings in other ways. Yeah, here is a short list of common string operations across languages. Yeah. Yeah. In this case, we will look for them into JavaScript. Let's say, let's come here. Let's say the name our name equals hello no. Let's say James. James Timberlake. Timberlake, like that, okay? Bam. Now we will do three operations. First with the index of it is finding the position of the character in a string so we don't need to look like one index like first index second index third index not we don't need to do it we can find very fast or we can do it let's do it come here say var find index equals name index of now what ladder we want to find index of this ladder let's say e we want to find e in this sentence like in this full name okay e yeah let's say enter after that, let's say console.log, let's say find index, bam, it's saying 7 index, that's amazing, we find it, right, let's look, the computer saying lie, the programming is lie, in this case, like is that lie, okay, we can prove it, I can convince you, James, is the let's look from here the zero one two three four yeah five six seven yeah that's seven let's look for another's we want to look for e right maybe a okay we want to look for a let's say a in this case or E. We have two E here. The first one here, the second one here, the third one here. And we have one, two, three, A. Okay, E, sorry. Let's look. Console that. That log. And uh, what we are looking, find index. Find index. Our variable. It's saying three. Yeah, the our E it's staying first for here, right? Zero, one, two, three. Okay, it works. But what I want to do, you know, I want to show you all of them in one point. Say the first we have this name, after that we have find index for E, maybe not E, maybe E. Okay. Now, let's look for the to lowercase and to uppercase. Okay. Let's say var lower, lowercase like that. Okay. The shorter variable name. Okay. Let's say name to lower, to lowercase. Open it. What is our point here? 
we don't need to put anything it will work like that okay just like that now it will make everything lower okay g g like j and t will be in this case small how we can prove it let's do it console that log after that let's say lower 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 see like we represented it like that bam everything slow like lower now right the first one is g is bigger uh, the t bigger now in this case this is smaller okay it works right now again i'm coming here and first find it after that find this one after that find the lowercase point yeah now we will look for uppercase let's say variable upper case like that and let's say name to upper case this we should put it like that put semicolon um now you want you want to see that okay i can show you let's say console that log upper case like upper c this is our variable name James to me like now everything bigger everything upper right upper case everything upper it works now clear and clear also this one let's come again james timberlake and after that let's come e after that let's put uh, the upper no lower case after that let's come for upper upper one where is upper upper right here now let's look for the length it's because finding the position of character in a string index of converting a string to all lowercase or uppercase so in this case to lowercase and uppercase and reporting the length of a string so we shouldn't need to count them like how many letters have like in the this sentence like we don't need to do it this is easy with programming how we can do it let's say var length of length of name okay length of name okay da, 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 da. let's say name length okay only that put semicolon it will work now let's show everything no not everything first show it after that we can show another things too lock and da, 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 length of right our variable name what length of name put semicolon bam it's saying 16 really we have 16 so are we have 16 let's do 0 1 2 3 4 like 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 right we have 16 ladder in name that we commence it now we have variables here and all we did we can get what we want from our string variables with this methods or functions or building functions or anything else like commands okay it works in python like say again name equals uh let's say john 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 i don't know john anything john merrill john merrill like that yeah let's say the first uh, the index of let's say index index and like index name 
uh, we want because we are looking index of some some letters index name and say name dot index of after that open it like that and say we are looking for n right or to m let's say n in this case we are looking for that one the index of this what is saying no attribute index of oh in this case maybe it is different in python also you can search it right let's say python index of um yeah let's look index i think you just saying index okay let's come here and say index and say n yeah it works let's say print index n bam it's saying three really it's three zero one two three it is three we did so after that let's say do we want to look for the lowercase or the uppercase how we can do it in python let's look at say what you know let's say the two upper name let's say name to upper case it's saying not to uppercase it's no have there to lowercase sorry let's say do we have so you can search python to lower case how it works in python string lower just you saying lower this is very easy just you searching right for python you're just doing like what you know just you saying lower yeah print to upper name but in this case this is not upper let's say to Thing, upper yeah to upper name let's say print it will make everything to upper upper to upper name yeah yeah john merrill it is big one <laughs> okay now let's say we are looking for the lower to lower to lower name equals to name dot lower and after that put it here like that and say print to lower name bam it will say it will say it like that so everything will be lower and the last one let's say the length length of name equals name plus length only like that but let's say length. Oh, what is saying length? Length is not working. In the length. Let's look for the length. I think normally it's working like that. Python um, length. Len. Oh, sorry. This one is like len. Okay, okay. Come here and say len. But just do len. Oh, what is, why is not working? attribute len how we can do it in len method len oh, oh okay 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 no yeah it is different like you should do like what you know you should say len name um, after that let's say print length of name yeah saying 10 in every programming languages the syntax or the functions or the things different okay in JavaScript it's different in Python different in every programming languages is different I'm making lots of mistake because I want to show you like how the system works everyone can can make mistakes but the way efficient learning the mistakes okay with it 
everything here. Da, 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 da. Yeah, we did all of them. Just I want to show you one more thing. I can show I can show you. We can do substring like that. We did already chain operations together. We can do two command at the same time, two build in, in at the same time. How we can do it? Let's say, let's say, in this case, let me also with this point with the clear. Let's say Python. Okay, let's come back to here. Say variable name and Mohammed Songer. This is my name and surname, full name. After that, let's close it. Now I want to get from here Mohammed. I want to make it to upper to upper uh, to uppercase. After that, I want to separate it. How oh, I can do it? I can do it like what you know? Or Let's say um, upper and let's say upper and sub like you know okay upper and sub string uh, name this is very long okay upper and sub string name let's say here name first after that let's say first to upper to uppercase okay and do it like that and click and like click that again or let's do it like that after that let's say sub but uh, I think the first substring one minute substring and after that let's first take this uh, zero one two three I can do it with index and um, like index of but let me look like that zero one two three four five six uh, zero it's start point okay zero after that zero one like zero one two three four five six seven eight this is total eight I think right mm. Two, four, six, eight. Yeah, eight. After that, this is start position and length of the letter Mohammed. And after that, let's put here to uppercase. To uppercase. Now, what it will do, you know? It will make Mohammed upper, and it will get from name only Mohammed. Let's do it. And max Songer lower and tag from there. How we can do it? The same way, let's say var mm, lower our variable name, lower and sub name. Okay. Equals name dot substring. Open it. After that, the start position will be what? This is 9, let's say 9, 11, not, no, 9, 10. Let's say 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Yeah, 7, 8, 9. Yeah, start position is 9. After that, it is occurring with the 6 letter. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6. I hope I did not wrong. After that, let's say to lower case. Bam. Close that. Yeah. Now let's say with alert. I want to show you with alert what we did. The first one, upper and sub name. Yeah. The second one will be lower, lower and sub name. Muhammad. It works only Muhammad. Yeah. Let's do it with console.log. Maybe it will show us good because alert is just showing only thing here. Yeah. Muhammad is the this one, upper and sub name with the yeah, this point. This is uppercase. It tags from there this. And after that we did lowercase for Songer. So we can look them also in that way. Let's say um, lower and sub name. 
Songur. Did you see? We got from there with the lower case with this phone with this codes. And another one. Just let's put name and just come here, say upper. Upper. Bam. Upper and sub name. Yeah, it will show us moment. It works like that. Okay? This is another way. That second line for the uppercase function which returns like that. In Pseudo code for string operations, since many programming languages use procedures for string operations instead of operators like plus, that is how we'll likely use them in Pseudo code. For example, here is a description of a concatenation procedure. But before that, I want to do it in Python 2. Let's say name Mohammed Songer. Songer. Yeah, do it like that. After that, let's say and the lower name lower and sub name okay in this case let's say num like name and after that bam like that first we want to get moments zero from zero one zero one two three four five six seven let's say eight eight after that, let's say what lower. Yeah, int. But also do for upper and sub name equals name up up. Come inside it. Zero one two. Let's do different crazy things. Let's say this is. Uh, minus one is the R, minus two is the U, minus three is the G, minus four is the O, minus five is the S, minus five. Let's say minus five. Bam. But minus five, put it here like that. What it will do? It will look after that. Okay? If you put it here, what it will be? It will look for another point. So it will look after that, okay? Before that. Let's do it like that. Do you think it will work? Let's say, um, but uh, in this point, let's put it there. I think it's this one, yeah. And let's say upper, like that. Let's say print lower and sub name like that and upper and sub name Mohammed Mohammed S because why let's come here tag this one to here Let's try it again now. Google. Because this is a six. Yeah. Let's do it now. Mohammed Song. It will show us like that. But if we just want to look for upper upper, let's say for upper Mohammed. It is lower and just we get the slices with some way. After that, let's say upper song. It is big and we get from slices and we get to uppercase. Yeah, it's that like that. Just clear Python. Bam. Since my programming language, I did it. Concat, it's the way how to do in Pseudo codes. Concat string one, string two, concatenate string one and string two returning to combine. String is the same way like are we doing it. The following are like if you have papers, you can write on the papers with your pencil, like this way, say the codes. Uh, this is way like how we concatenating it. The concatenate mean it can be here like substring. No, 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 sorry, not substring, it's addition point like, okay, this is, this mean is addition, okay, like that. So, uh, let's come down. Home. 
the variable name, the concat mean like dark house, let's think like the concat mean like here, but that, okay? The poseido code slice means slice is like substring, starts like st string. It means like when you do it like to the substring, after that, when you put inside it a start position and length, this is the same in that way. But in poseido code, it's look, it's look like slice. After that, you put in the first string and start and length. Returns to something, the same thing, like, okay? This line of code, poseido code slice, other than in the variable nickname. Nickname slice Daniel, yeah, okay, it will look like for, you know, like it will start with the, uh, with the, with the one. Uh, in programming, it's the index starting with the zero. In Poseidon codes or in the normal life, it's starting with from one, okay? It's the, like, what, you know, the one, two, three. It's done in three, like one, start position, length, the one, two, three. What is that? The Poseido code assumes the first index of the string is one, whereas the first index of string in JavaScript and many other languages uh, is zero. Pay close attention to this description of any procedures involving in this size. Check our understanding. What is the Poseido code equivalent of this code? San Diego substring. San Diego substring. Okay, let's look at the zero, one, two, three, like zero, one, two. Sun, yeah. It's look, it's saying like the in pseudo code equivalent of this JavaScript. In pseudo code, it will be it will start with the first index like one, two, like one. After that, length of it three. This one will be answer. The start position will be one. In JavaScript, this is zero one two. It will be like zero length of that it will be three zero three but in pseudo code it will start like first one after that the length of that sum it will be three yeah that's the answer let's come here and look the uh, this ones string operations practice questions okay let me check it let me check all of them all of them yeah Adam is working on a program that can generate domain names this program uses the following procedure for string concatenation. Concatenate string one, string two. In this case, the variables are at the start of this program. It, so we want to look for the cactus.io. So cactus here, company, the io here, till two, uh, tld2. So just we should concatenate cactus and tld. How we can do it? We can do, but also we have dot here. So we can do that, concatenate, okay. After that, first company, cactus. After that, we have dot, but we don't have concatenation method here. Like, yeah, it will not work. Oh, it's saying con company. Um, after that, it's saying concatenate plus and that one. Do you think it is true? Oh, tag this one too. In this case, like that concatenate because the first variable is string after that the another starting yeah the first variable and second okay it will work there yeah it will work and this one company concatenate but no it will not work you should separate it the second one here it's saying company plus that plus da, 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 it will work okay answer let's come down but this is yeah the many more answers always there regina is writing a program that is important upon numbers the program relies on multiple string operations concate we have two like string one string two the concatenates joins two strings on it the three is the just framing it voice space at the beginning like this Three mean like you just tacking empty points, like empty stage. Here is a snippet of her code. In user phone, it will take this uh, snippets points from there, like space. It will take this space. Uh, saying as phone, concat, concatenation mean. The US code is zero, like plus one. After that, we have one empty point here it will trim there trim user phone after that it will take all of them yeah it will be like 
what if we get it trim it will work it will work like what you know i will tell you now plus one if we get in this point space here we have one space the trim will not max space there it will delete it and it will be like that wow. let's come down let's pause it and you can do it where is my program to so the program is following process of string like substring in this case, substring, string, start position, num charts. Okay. Da, 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 da. This program starts with this line of code 03, da, 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 31. Da, da. In this line, of displays the year, this is 84. Okay, we want to get that. Display substring. Yeah. In this case, we send display substring. It means like console.log, substring, our building functions or command. And uh, substring, uh, the user by a, the string first after that the start position one two because this is um, say the codes one two three four five six and it will be six it's not true it will be seven this length of that will be two that one is true answer yeah let me continue the first the fourth one nori is writing a call for a website that publishes attention grabbing new articles the call relies on the multiple string operations concatenate string one string two yeah probably the string that is operating her codes use the variables title one the cat rib six mass title two cancer title three new color anyway in this case which of three following expressions results in the string cat stock ended in three four weeks cat stock in three four weeks this one okay we are looking for this one title two but we have three mark like yeah we should bring them next next how we can do it and this is title two right if you're not wrong yeah we sang upper concatenate title and that one it will work do you think it will work the other one upper concatenate title this one title two plus this it will work do you think it will work first we will make upper after that we will put in concatenate title two plus this what do you think the first one concatenate we put already in upper after that we say concatenate title and this one but point how we can concatenate string one string two okay it will work that's true yeah the second one concatenate title two plus this upper concatenate title two plus this so do you think it will work we have plus here so concatenate title two upper no that's one wrong concatenate upper yeah title two plus yeah, it works. Concatenate upper title two. So anyway, that's the way. Okay. Oh, what I did. Okay. Why it's like that? Let's be fast. This is way. So the another one will be programming quiz. Quiz one. The this is our second part. Uh, for the for the for the string operations i hope you get it right let's come here yeah this is second part for string operations thank you so much for joining the another lecture will be programming quiz one after that we'll start for the conditions if else while for for everything so thank you so much for for join and another lecture i told you another video will be about programming part like programming quiz one thank you so much for joining have a good time